Hi there. In this video, we're going to do a brief overview on how to use a model sheet in Adaptive Instance. So as you can see, we're already in a model sheet, but just a frame of reference on how to navigate to the model sheet. This menu button on the top left, click on Sheets, and then you could select the sheet you want to use. And we're going to be in the balance sheet. So as you can see here, on the left, we have the different hierarchies of the different accounts at roll up to their parents. So we have cash, AR, allows for downfall accounts, and you can see they all roll up to current assets. So if you click this triangle, you could have them aggregate to the one amount. So moving over to the data, as you can see, there's some of these numbers in green, which those are actuals and won't be able to be changed here. And the cells that are in white, those are able to be adjusted. So let's say we want to make a change, change this 300 to 325, put that amount in, press enter. Now you could see those amounts turn blue, which represents that these are not been saved in the system yet. So let's go ahead and press the save button. Now these numbers will be saved in the system and be able to be viewed by other users. And a quick note, if there's multiple users that are in this sheet, as long as two people aren't in the same exact cell at the same time, people could be making updates simultaneously. Also, let's say you made a change to a number and you wanted to add a note, you could right click on a cell and add a note. So let's say, want to add some notes in. Now there's a carrot that shows, okay, there are notes in this cell. And a couple of other nice features about the model sheet. Let's say we want to export this into Excel. There's this download button and it will export it right there for use in Excel. Pretty nice feature. Then another cool feature is this display options button. So as you can see, we currently have the monthly and annual view, but let's say we only wanted to take a look at the annual view. We'd remove the checks there, press okay. And now we have the annual view. Another cool feature is this levels. So we're currently looking at only the North sales, but let's say we wanted to look at all of company A. We could click that. Now this will show the total view for company A. So that's a high level view of how to use a model sheet. If you have any questions, put them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching and hope this helped.